What's up everybody? This is Maddie from Maddie's Review Channel. Today we're going to cover something a little different. We're going to cover about Mac Windows pop-up scams and how you can get rid of them. Stay tuned. Okay, I'm pretty sure if you guys have been on the internet for a long time, you guys came across these, these uh, notifications when you're browsing on your internet browser, um, which are very annoying, it tells you that you need to call a number um, or you cannot use your computer. So I'm going to show you how to get rid of this. And we're going to go ahead and start with the Apple computer. First, what we want to do, this is very annoying. Um, right here, it'll tell you what you should do in the steps to get rid of this. Um, what you want to do is you want to reset your browser. You want to force quit and restart your browser. You want to delete your Safari preferences manually. Um, we're going to go ahead and reset our preferences. We're going to click on Safari. You're going to go into preferences. You're going to remove all website data. And it's going to ask you if you want to confirm. You want to remove them now. So you're going to go ahead and click remove them now. And then down here it's going to say show develop menu and menu bar. So you're going to go ahead and check on this. Then you'll get in the develop section. You're going to go ahead and empty caches. And then what you're going to do is you're going to check all these and you want to reset all these datas. And then you want to go ahead and you want to force quit your Safari. And that should take care of the problem. Um, sometimes I actually restart my computer to make sure that it fully takes. So that's how you uh, remove that annoying little message in your Safari. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get to Windows. I'm not a Windows user. I've just found some information on it. So you want to go into the gear icon. Then you want to click the Internet Options. In the Internet Options dialog box, you want to click Advanced Tab. Click on the reset button. And then you want to delete personal settings, which is um, reset button. And that should take care of it in the Windows in. I don't know very much of Windows as I don't use Windows. I'm only a Mac user. So this should help you remove that pesky little uh, annoying pop-up error. Thanks for watching.